We are on our quest for the imaginary Jersey hard roll. And this day is dedicated to finding that hard roll. We are in, what city are we in? Fairfield, Fairfield, New Jersey, where we're staying. And our first attempt looked good, but it actually wasn't the real thing. I'm gonna turn the camera about here and show you uh, what's, uh, what's going on here. At our first stop, we got uh, what they called their hard Kaiser roll, and the seated one and an unseated one. And they seemed close. They weren't quite as dark, and the pinwheel's not as pronounced. But then on our way out checkout, there was pre-made wax-wrapped buttered hard rolls. And I thought, oh my, that's it. <clears throat> and guess what? I bit into it, and it was not. <laughs> to explain it, it was a lot like this roll, and it was good, but it was there was no difference in the consistency from the outside to the inside. A proper hard roll is going to be really crunchy and chewy on the outside and have a pillowy softness in the middle. We just left another bakery. So this is Sorrento Bakery. And it's the uh, same town, I think, Fairfield or... Hanover. Oh, it's in Hanover. Okay, and this roll, um, bakery looked classic. In fact, we got some crumb cake and some other things there that looked really authentic. And the, um, the best we could do on the hard roll, I'm going to uh, dissect. So here it is. It's pretty crunchy on the outside. It's not very dark. It doesn't have the pinwheel. So I already know it's not the right thing. However, it is pretty good. I'm gonna rip it open. Let's see what the inside's like. It's messy in the car. Uh, it's actually pretty good, but it is still not it. The the consistency's not that not that moist and let's see. It's got some good chew to the outside. <laughs> but I would consider it a good lunch roll <clears throat> but without the pin and wheel and the nice dark top it's not it so we're going to go to the next bakery kind of hard alright let's see All right. uh, okay just a chocolate iced donut a Bavarian cream that is the right size, unlike the one I bought earlier this morning. That was like a cupcake. All right, this is the proper one. And then the classic New Jersey crumb cake. Can't wait. Well, we just drove about, what, 15? Yeah, 15, 20 minutes to the next one on our list. Went inside. It was obviously a very nice bakery. It smelled great. There was a ton of people inside in line which I don't think they took kindly to me uh, walking around the store and looking in the cases and, you know, just basically appearing to cut in, which I was not doing. But I did not see any likeness to the hard roll. But it looked like a great bakery and it was crowded. So on to the next one. This bakery from, um, where are we? Packinac, Packinac Lake. From the Packinac Bakery, we got a vanilla, Donut looks great, and a pumpkin delight also looks really nice. But they did not have what we were looking for. Yes, it seems like the the fairy tale of the hard hard roll is disappearing. We're going to one more bakery right now before we take a break. Uh, but I have hopes for the pumpkin lights bakery, but we'll see. Um, it looks to me like this, um, this item is disappearing, and I think I'll, I'm going to have a conclusion here for you soon. I'm going to take this hard roll, which does feel like a hard roll. Has the pinwheel, has the poppy seeds. I'm going to just go ahead and break into it. See how it is. not bad but it's not the same thing for a couple of reasons 
This is fairly cloudy. This is dusty, dry, and it should be firm and chewy. So, I guess this is as close as they come, unless it comes from a certain bakery. See how this just, it just crumbles into dust? Shouldn't do that. So, you've not made it yet. Sorry. Good morning, people. This is our day three in New Jersey and our second day of searching for the infamous Jersey Hard Roll. Today we're going to Denville, about our furthest point, and going to a father-son bakery that uh, also has a deli. So if any place has a chance, it could be. So stay tuned. We found Anthony and Son's Bakery, and it is um, not small. It's a big operation, probably a wholesale provider. And I'm gonna take you outside and whip the camera around a few times so you can see what's here. And maybe we found it. All right, we are rolling. And this is the retail front of this ginormous bakery. But now we're gonna take a look at the product. Ready? Okay, there we go. Now they told me in advance they didn't have the uh, poppy seed inversion, but it is totally fresh. The young man went back in the factory to get a single Kaiser roll for me. Spiral top is nice. That's a nice feel. Kind of soft, but smells good. Here we go. Ooh, that's a nice tear. Very tasty, pretty crunchy. Very close indeed. Mm. I'd say the best so far. It doesn't have that dusting kind of feel to it. It's quite, quite nice. I'll let somebody else try one. If not. It's the closest thing, but it's fresh. Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh. Top's not quite as hot, hard, you know, but it doesn't have the depth of flavors that the darker rolls do. But it's a nice roll. I'm sorry. Yeah.